The Arkansas Razorbacks are at odds of 100 to 1 to win the college football national championship. And they are at odds of plus 1300 to win the Southeastern Conference Championship. Last season saw the Razorbacks go 8 and 5 straight up while going 5 and 3 in the SEC. The team went 8 and 5 against the spread and 6 and 7 on the over under. The Arkansas Razorbacks head coach Brett Bellema has done things his own way, defiantly sticking to power running behind a gargantuan offensive line with a mix of play action passing. Arkansas is coming off back-to-back -back bowl seasons and went 5-3 in the SEC play last year, which included a signature 31-14 payout at the all-powerful LSU. Arkansas has been very competitive with Alabama in the past two seasons, including a near upset in 2014, and they get to play the Tide at home in 2016. The Razorbacks also showed great character, recovering from a 2-4 start last season. This year, Balema faces his greatest challenge as most of the key components from his offense are gone. But he has recruited well, and he has built a culture and an admirable program that will sustain success. Balema has the guts to defy the critics and the current trend of the game, and it's working for him. The bad news is that star quarterback Brandon Allen has departed after serving as starter for all three of Brett Balema's seasons with the team. The good news is that Allen's younger brother, Austin Allen, will take over at quarterback. The junior signal caller is a bit more of a gambling gunslinger that is not afraid to take a chance, which can lead to both exciting football and frustrating mistakes. As always, however, a strong running game is the centerpiece of a Balema coach football team and will be anchored by one of the largest offensive lines in all of football, pro or college. Top back Alex Collins took off for the riches of the NFL after rushing for over 1,500 yards last year. Cody Walker is looking to fill that void behind three new starters on the offensive line. Arkansas will field one of the more experienced defenses in the SEC and will rely upon it to help through the transition of so many new faces on offense. The defense may be experienced but certainly needs to become more consistent and reliable after ranking 58th overall in the nation in 2015, as well as 117th against the pass and 68th for points allowed. Vast improvement is expected on the pass rush and the secondary after giving up far too many big plays last year. To be fair, the unit was young and inexperienced last season and showed improvement late on the stretch run. The Razorbacks will have tough games at TCU Texas A&M, Auburn, and Mississippi State against the Bulldogs, and at home against the Florida Gators, LSU Tigers, Alabama Crimson Tide, and Ole Miss Rebels, which are all winnable games, but they are also all losable games. While the inexperienced offense is a concern, Bill Emma sticking to his guns and his system offsets those worries a bit. This will not be a championship year for the Razorbacks, but it should be a satisfying one in which Arkansas goes bowling yet again with another big upset win or two along the way. Join us at BetDSI.com for the best Arkansas Razorbacks betting options, including futures, props, and live in-progress betting during the game.